Ondo, the second largest city in Ondo State in southwest Nigeria, is known for its rich culture. And this the people did not fail to exhibit recently as they hosted the Minister of Communication Technology, Omobala Johnson. The minister has come to commission one of the over 800 rural information technology centers spread across Nigeria, an initiative designed to improve internet access to the rural and semi-urban areas in the country. For the people of Ondo Town, computers with internet access and huge e-library is being commissioned, and the minister urged them to take advantage of this resource. Today there are five in Ondo Town. One is in the Obadisoy Civic Center. The second one is right here in the, in the palace. The third one is in Nipost, also in Ondo Town. The fourth one is at the local government secretariat. The event, which was well attended by indigents of Ondo, attracted students from secondary and tertiary institutions in the town and its environs. Here's what the students say about the center. To this, the launching of the ICT center, I think students will be able to receive information faster and also the ICT program center will allow us to know more about what's going on in our environment through the technology provided for us. As a student, we have a lot to learn. Everything is going digital. We have easy access to information. It makes academics easier and so many other benefits. We have a lot to gain from the ICT program, a lot. The National Information Technology Development Agency, NIDDA, is an agency that has been deploying ICT centers. The agency did not fail to stress the need for the community to own the project by ensuring it is secured and maintained. This is just an opportunity being given to the youth by the federal government through our able minister. This center is meant for you to use in your studies and research. This center is to be used to add more to what you have been taught in your various institutions. High point of the event was a presentation of gift to the minister who is a daughter of the state. For the traditional ruler of Ondo town, it's gratitude to the minister and the federal government. A new chapter is opened in Ondo Kingdom. A chapter that will enable our children, our sons and daughters, to be more computer literate, to be more I mean, information technology literate. It's going to be, and I'm sure this is probably going to be the first community-based e-library in this part of the world.